Well, the Queen's men on BET Plus is making a lot of noise, and the leading man, Sky Black, is perhaps the biggest success story in entertainment I've seen in a long time. Okay, I had the chance to ask about the second part of season two and how he feels about the evolution of his character Amp, but also his own personal career. It's an inspiring story that everyone needs to hear. Sky, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me this morning. No problem. So you got to tell me, what can we expect out of all the Queen's men this season? Oh, man, the magic question. I'll say this. The most I can say is expect the unexpected. Ooh. And and what you have seen for the first two episodes of season 2B, you haven't seen anything yet. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> and the lastly, I would say, this season, you really see why Amp and Madam are related. They are very similar people. <laughs> oh, okay, I like that. I like that. Talk to me a little bit about your your character and the evolution of him. I heard that uh, with the new season, you wrote like a 12-page background on, on Amp and, and where he's going, where he's been. Tell me a little bit about the evol evolution of that. How did you hear that, actually? <laughs> I did my own work. <laughs> yeah, you did your research. <laughs> no, I, when, I, when I first got the character, um, I, I, that's, that's kind of one of my little processes. I, I sit back and I, I honestly, I asked God, I was like, just flow through me with the pen. And whatever happens, happens. And so I start out with my name and birth date of whatever character it is, and I end it. So with Amp, I got to like 12 pages. I did get to 12 pages. Speaking of evolution of, of this character, your career has been an evolution in itself. Like you were a dan you were a dancer for Beyonce, but now you you have landed this job and you were on Sisters as well. Tell talk to me a little bit about your the evolution of that for you, because I heard also, because I do my homework, <laughs> you were just a few years ago, you were like parking cars for valet services. And now you're this huge star on this amazing show that's a, a great hit. How did we get here? <laughs> Yo, um, this is such an honest moment. I feel like the, I've been on a press tour all this morning, right? And you are the first person that have made me become emotional. Oh. I literally almost teared up. Like it's um, woo. I um let it out. It's all right. Yeah, I'm grateful, man. I I um it, it, you know, being an artist is it's, it's hard work. And um two years ago I was valley parking cars. And well now, yeah, three years ago. Three years ago, I spent my my New Year's at the West Hollywood edition doing a double just so I could get money, extra money. And um, this year I spent it with my fiance that I met in Sisters in St. Barnes. So um, I'm like, <laughs> I'm actually blown away every day. And I'm just extremely grateful that I get to do what I love for a living. And um, it's changed my life, man. And all I can say to that is, as, as I'm tearing up and trying not to cry, that's what it goes more. If anybody out there has a dream, man, you follow it, bro. Like, you follow, 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 follow that dream because it was given to you. It wasn't given to anybody else. And even when people don't understand, even when it's, even when times are rough, keep going. Yeah. Keep going. I mean, I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a living witness. I'm up here on, on the, in the morning, just tears of joy and gratitude and um i i am um i'm so full at the moment I, and now i'm producing too so i am yeah yeah, yeah. well i great. love that as a as a viewer of the show i have to say to you thank you for following your passion because i mean you're so amazing at what you do and we wouldn't have this dynamic of amp on, on uh all the queen's men if you didn't follow your passion and do what you do so i i thank you for being a, a living testimony of everyone going thank out you. there and following their dreams thank you thank you that's what it's about right i think um in life, we should be vessels and be some because our story could help someone else. Mm -hmm.
So a million percent. Yeah. And I hope it helps somebody with this interview. Somebody watching wants to be a star <laughs> out there. <laughs> Thank you so much, Scott, for being here. We really appreciate your time. And we will all be tuning in to All the Queens Met.